Terry from Eric Sport, you guys are going to be blown away, we hope, just as much as we've been. We're having the visit from a scientist, a public speaker, martial arts guy from France, in Goub, and he's showing us how simple it is to integrate uh, energetic medicine with the Indian clubs. Now, we know Indian clubs. This is totally new for us. You know, stuff that we haven't seen before, different planes of motion, different type of timing to what we usually do. We're learning new stuff, we're blown away, and we're feeling like kids, like Bambi on ice, right? So check out some of the stuff that we're doing, and uh, if you want to learn more, drop a comment, give us a like, get in touch with us, with any of Guys, I'm so happy to be here. Thank you so much for having me. You're it's welcome. our pleasure. <laughs> no, really, yeah. seriously, guys. Lots yeah. of interesting stuff. It's These heroic sport retreats are as beneficial for us as it is for you. Oh, thank you, thank you, thank you. So, uh, just for our good friends there, the viewers, um, let's say a little bit about, um, I would like to tell you who I am, and I would like sure. you again to tell who you are to the people and, and why we're here. W would that work for you guys? Perfect. Sure. Okay. So, I'll start, all right? You go. So, my name is Ngub Ding. I'm a pharmacist, a researcher, a scientist, and I'm also passionate and quite savvy in uh, traditional medicines. Mm -hmm. So, I combine those two, and what I do is I'm specialized in mind-body connections. How to make that work in an optimal fashion. So, you could say that I'm a mind trainer in, in, some, in some fashion, right? So, that's my background. And I'm here because I can see and I've experienced uh, directly and with my clients some great benefits with club swinging and especially using the palavendal uh, twist on that on you know, the mind-body connection. That's really why I'm here. And I really wanted to meet you guys to make the best of it. So what about you guys? Please tell my people who you are. Um, yeah, why we're so glad that you're here is because this is opening up something that we've been suspicious of right from the beginning. We always have been telling people that this mobility in motion... Uh, uh, it's a form of meditation in motion, right? Like uh, yeah. this kind of stuff that we do is like incorporating the mind and the body at the same time. Of course, you can look at it as just a purely physical, but that aspect is very important to us and uh, very dear to us. So it's, it's totally awesome that you can bring a new dimension into it because we're looking at traditional exercise using the, the wooden clubs. You're bringing the traditional medicines aspect into yes. it. It's just going to be awesome. Yeah. And with your expertise, this is how we're going to be able to explain it better to people about what we're talking about. This reboot your mind and body. That yes. This is not yes. only about um, mobility, but it's also about the positive energy that you can collect from doing this type of training. Yes. So it's it's totally amazing. We've been looking forward to it. Oh, nice. I'm a, an inventor that can't look at something without thinking, how can I make that better? <laughs> Which makes us a perfect uh, match because Terry's the sports fanatic, expert. Uh, he's a, 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 a fly paper that collects all this information and gives it to me. Ron, can we do this? So this is just another cog in the wheel uh, for, for what we do, and we're looking so much forward to giving it out there together with you. Okay, great. So let me just put something out there. You, you might have heard, mobility is longevity, right? Yeah. Mm -hmm. that, and it makes sense somehow. Mm -hmm. So y people uh, kind of see what you do mostly as physical mobility. Well, there is such a thing as the mobility of the mind the mind flexibility, the ability to associate ideas, yes. the ability to adapt to unforeseen, unexpected new situations. Just like physically, if I'm pushing you, all of a sudden your body has to adapt. Yes. Yep. You know? And mentally, it's the same. And there's something linking those two, which actually um, is really making them one. We only experience them as two because we've been conditioned that way. And that's what I'm focused on. What the ancient were calling vital energy. 
you know, life force, or whatever, prana, chi, whatever. Yeah. That's what it is about, right? And that's what's making the body and the mind as one. And with what I was actually amazed by is how the club swinging and the, the results with the power vendors are really great for one simple reason. It makes it completely adaptable to the, the actual needs of the person. To the, to the gram, if we, if we yes. need to, if we want yes. to, if we choose to. So then it becomes something really personal that can really answer one's needs. That's what is so fantastic about it. And what I was surprised by is how movement, how simple, basic movement, what I call the alphabet, mm -hmm. you know, the basic movement, mm -hmm. how that corresponds to very specific um, energetic structures in the human body. That really baffled me. Yeah, I mean, the, the conversation we had already just yesterday when, when you first came to Denmark there, I was just like, whoa, okay, this is going to be, it's going to be very good. Yeah. yeah. Looking forward to it. Yeah. So um, in the next video, we will show people which movement corresponds to which meridian. Mm -hmm. Okay. So that they can try, they can start an experiment with that, and they can start and have a certain feel about it. Right. So for those who have that kind of culture, they will know what to make of it. For those who don't, we'll give them um, um, some. Um, um, Basic, I mean, we're going to use basic exercise from what I understood. So everybody should basically be able to follow along and try the yes. at home. And if you don't have a club, well, you just start with a bottle. With a bottle. And then, yes. you know. Get a handle. Come on. Yeah. That's, that's simple enough. Yeah. And the idea is to, to give a set of movements in, in a combination manner mm -hmm. that would make sense for the body. Something standard to start with. Yep. And we're looking forward to have your comments on that. Tell us what it does for you. Especially for those who are used to club swinging, right? So tell us to, to do it in that way. What's the difference? How do you, what do you observe? Because it's really the beginning of something here. Yeah. Yeah. I hope together with, with you, and I mean, Terry has always impressed me with the knowledge that he gives to me, that we can explain to folk, uh, people, that it's, this isn't a generic type of training. We can actually do it on a personal level, yeah. right from one pound club or three pound, or six pound club. And this ability to design it exactly for you I think is going to be an incredible experience. Absolutely. And that's why then designing the type of movement that the person is going to benefit the most from with the optimal weight and, and we can, with, for, for the optimal length of time and or the optimal number of repetitions, then it becomes such a neat way to really communicate between the mind and the body. And those, you know, those are what you could call points of coherence. Mm -hmm. Like, you know, places where the whole system talks with all the other parts. Yeah. And that's what we can make uh, happening very, very easily with those uh, power vandals. Yeah. So it becomes like a clockwork, basically. Right? Exactly. Just everything yes. is just in sync. Yeah. And that's uh, totally new. And. Um, well, the fun thing is, you know, um, in, in what I do, I really focus on what I call the natural state as opposed to the habitual state and occasional disturbances. Mm. But the, we, we all have habitual states. And it's so easy to get confused and think that what we used to mm -hmm. is our nature. Mm. It is false 99.9% .9 of the time. Our true nature is much better off with everything. We have energy to adapt. What we want is what's good for us. And the whole nine yards. Mm. Who's experienced that they want something that's not good for them? Everybody. Mm. That's not natural. See? And what, we, what you're doing with that, you know, when you are having the, 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 the shoulder move in its natural range of motion, mm. You're helping people finding back their natural states. Mm -hmm. And that's what we're talking about, you know? The flow of vital energy, and we, we're going to make it so simple for you guys, you, so that even though you don't know all the mechanics, you can actually experience it, you know? As we say, you don't need to be a mechanic to drive a car appropriately. So that's, I'm the mechanic. You don't need to be the mechanic. What you need is to learn how to drive. Right. Exactly. So if you're curious about this and you've been thinking about engine clubs, but you think, oh, it looks a bit silly, or I don't think it, just try it. Like within five minutes, you're going to find it's like, whoa, discovering new things about your body and 
you're going to experience how enjoyable and fun it can be. Yes. And that's, you know, everybody that comes to a workshop, everybody we do demonstration with, at first they're like a bit like resistant and then they just go, oh, yeah, okay. I can feel that. I want to set or yeah. where can I join class or, yeah. or whatever. So, uh, 